Tonight we continue our coverage on road conditions across the capital city and metro area. The Arkansas Department of Transportation warning you to stay off the roads if at all possible. Our Alexis Wainwright has been out and joins us live with more. Alexis, how are things looking where you are? Well, Laura, we're right off of Interstate 630 and some cars are taking it slow. Others are not so lucky and they're keeping those local towing companies very busy. This side of this road right here, it's a lot of snow. I'm going to measure it right now so you can see just how deep some of these areas are. Right now we're looking at almost 10 inches and tow truck drivers are reminding people that these roads are safe or aren't safe to be on. I've seen this about six or seven years ago, but not, not as bad as this. It's been a long time since Central Arkansas has seen weather like this. They're slick. you got to drive with very good cautions, and you got to be extremely careful. They're very dangerous. Monday, it looks like a ghost town along many of the major interstates across Little Rock. All, all of our records are on uh, standby. For some, though, it's their job to be on the roads in conditions like this. They're, they're afraid of an accident. They're afraid of themselves getting hurt. And, but they're still wanting to try to help people. And that's, that's what they're doing. Crews with J-Hook Towing and Recovery have been out nonstop helping drivers stuck on the roads. So far, they've responded to 35 calls. General Manager Tim Moody offering advice to those who have no choice but to be out. But if you have to get out, Drive extremely carefully, don't brake, and don't accelerate, and drive with real low speeds. Now, I just talked with Moody a few minutes ago. He says that they are still pulling out semis and other small cars. A lot of them, he says, are making the same mistakes and speeding on roads. For example, look at this parking lot here behind me. You can't tell where it starts and where it ends, so they want people to take it slow when they're out here on these roads. Reporting live tonight in Little Rock, Alexis Wainwright, KRK4 News. Laura. Alexis, thank you.